to the king, baby. Yes, sir. I need a weapon. For the Emperor! We are the Brotherhood of Steel. You will feel fear, Angel. I find your lack of faith disturbing. Hello everybody, this is Damien Plays Memoir 44 Online, and this is Mission 32, Flanking Maneuver at Bear Hakim. So, I just noticed there, so I'm playing the Axis Forces in this one, uh, so it's 70% victory for the Axis. Um, so, hopefully it goes my way today. Uh, I haven't recorded any memoir in a couple of weeks, I was just taking a break, uh, I had some uh, holiday from work and stuff like that, so just kind of took some time to myself to spend time with my fiance and stuff like that but uh yeah it should be uh regular you know regularly uh putting up some men uh memoir stuff so uh, from here on out again so anyway yeah let's uh do what we normally do and get straight into the game so the axis player the german italian player which i am will take six command cards for and uh, move first the adult player takes five command cards the conditions of victory are five medals each field bunker is a temporary metal objective, so these, if I take these, I get some metals only for the Axis forces. And exit markers are in effect on the partially allied baseline, uh, so there, okay. Um, North African rules are in effect, the desert rules, so uh, allied tanks only move two, uh, where my tanks move three. Uh, British Commonwealth forces and Italian, Italian Royal Army command rules are in effect. I can't remember the Italian Royal Army. The British Commonwealth are the ones that uh, they get stiff upper lip. Um, as in, if there's one unit left or one soldier left in the squad, they get to uh, attack back. Um, if I attack them, Oasis recovery rules. I'll have to just double check that. Um, German special forces. Anti tank weapons. Someone has anti. Okay, so this guy here is an anti tank weapon, and. My guy has an anti-tank weapon. That's grand. There's minefields. Yeah, I can see a lot of minefields. That's going to be a little bit scary, but um, we shall persevere. So I have engineers, Italian divisions, anti-tank weapons, and himself, he has the Oasis recovery, which I'll have to double check, and minefields, and he's British Commonwealth. So yeah, let's get into the historical context, and then let's get cracking. Following on the success of Operation Crusader, the British 8th Army had driven Rommel's forces out of Serenica, before overstretching its own supply lines again. Uh, again, sorry. 8th Army had, had then settled along the Gazala line in the desert, west of Tobruk, in a series of brigade strength occupied boxes protected by minefields and wire. The southernmost tip of the line was the fortified box at Bir Hakim held by the 1st Free French Brigade of General Pierre-Marie Koenig. At midday on May 26th, Rommel launched a faint frontal attack on the central positions of the Gazala line using small elements of the 20th Motorized Corps and truck-mounted propellers to blow dust and reinforce the deception, before pulling all his armoured elements back under cover of darkness. His real objective a daring flanking manoeuvre to neutralise the Bear Hakim box at the southern tip of the line, using the enemy's own minefields to protect his flanking rear. Apologies about the sound cutting, but the game hasn't even started yet, so that's, you know, I suppose it's not too bad. Um, luckily, I caught up before the game actually started. So, uh, but apologies about that. So, what will I do? Um... Hmm. What will I do? I will do a attack on the left flank. So I'm gonna choose these three. Oh yeah, Italian Royal Army. Okay, so I get to ignore a flag and also I get to uh, retreat back three hexes if I want to, up to three hexes. Okay, attack. I should get rid of that anti-tank. Come on, Jesus. 
Okay, one squad destroyed, and that's the anti-tank squad destroyed too, so... That's a, that's a good thing. Okay. I got another attack on the flank. The only problem is the bloody mines. Ooh, barrage. Interesting. Oh. Huh. Interesting. He destroyed it also. Huh. Okay, that was that. Uh, I mean, it worked. That was an interesting move. That was a very interesting move. Uh, okay. Uh, probe on the right flank. I'll send these two up. Uh, I don't think it makes a difference, does it? Uh, yeah, I'll take out these guys first. Come on. Okay. We'll retreat. Why are you loading? Mm. Okay. Just before we go on, I'm just going to double check. Okay, so uh, let's see. Firefight. I might do a firefight. I'll pick these two and these two. Okay, so. Uh, that worked out. That didn't. Huh. Okay. Got one wall, I suppose. Okay. Um. Try to take out their tanks. Oh, god damn it. Yeah, the one time I rolled three soldiers. <laughs> Bastards. Okay. Okay. So we're probing the right flank. Okay. Okay. Didn't work out for them. Eh, uh, what will I do? Attack the left flank. Go attack the left flank. Okay, we'll attack the left flank. I'll keep these two here, but I'll move. Yeah, these three. Don't. I'll move this guy to there. Okay, don't. Oh, for God's sake. Uh, <laughs> oh my God. Come on. He has a tether reader. I didn't even see them. Well, camouflage, I can say that. Alright. Tree assault, okay.
try and murder him now. With a probe. In the center. Okay. Done. Oh, you mother. Great. Not the end of my turn, is it? Or something? No. Still got the top of these. Okay. I'm killing all units. I'm killing all soldiers, not all units. Yes. Yeah, there. Jesus Christ, come on. Kill the unit, will you? And of course, he gets to do a stiff upper lip. And destroy one of the tanks. Great. Medics and mechanics. Okay. Well, he took out my artillery, so that's absolutely useless right now. That tank's is good. Yep. Three one. Remember, I meant to have a semi. Oh my god! How did this happen? <laughs> How does this happen? I meant to have a four one. Or sorry, seventy percent advantage over these. Can I do something quickly? We kind of force. Okay. Okay. Um. Okay. I'm gonna try something. So you move up to there. You move to there. And you move up to there. Okay. Oh my god. Yeah, just go away over there somewhere. <laughs> uh, okay. Took out one guy. <sighs> Start off pretty well. No, I direct from HQ. Treat. Uh, maybe I'll save myself. It would be funny if it weren't so cruel. <laughs> just before I go on, just let me double check. Yeah, we're all good. Okay, so might as well use direct from HQ because I'm pretty much dead anyway, so. So four units. Um but yeah, him 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 and him. Okay, you go back up there. You go You go here. You go up there. You go over there. Okay. I could do this. I'd have to... Yeah? Possibly do this. 
Maybe not. You know, I realized I can't. Sh well, he can't shoot over there, so possibly he can't. Yeah. Oh my god. Hail Mary. Oh man, wow. Okay. Huh. I pulled that back just. Uh wow. Yeah. <laughs> um Yeah, that was uh that was a Hail Mary. That was a complete Hail Mary. I had no control there. Only because I pulled that guy all the way back that I got that last chance that, that won it for me. Uh the actual map, it was, eh, there was nothing special about it, it was grand, it was fun enough, but I played better, played worse though, so, um, the game was pretty fun, but, uh, yeah, the dice the dice weren't uh, going with me today, let's just say that, um, but yeah, it was, it was an enjoyable enough game, um, I'm just looking at the stats, and he got 53% 50, hit rate on infantry, Mine was more varied, I suppose. I got a lot of kind of. I got 29%. I got just about 20% on, on everything, which is okay. I got. What was it? So for 58 dice, I got 23 hits, 40%. It says that he got less, but to be honest, it felt like more. I mean, I don't know. Well, no, that's the thing. I was killing a lot of soldiers, but I wasn't killing a lot of units, like the actual squads. He was taking out squads, and that's how he got to 4 1 very, very quickly. But that is the end of Flanking Maneuver Abur Hakim. The next map is called Panzers vs. Grants. So that should be an interesting map. I hope you enjoyed watching me play, and uh, I will see you on that one. And as always, thanks for watching.